Hey guys, it's me, your girl Anita, and I'm back with another video. And if you're new to my channel, I just want to say welcome, y'all. Welcome. I'm so happy to have you. And to all my returning subscribers, hey, y'all. Hey. Anyway, in this video, I'm going to be doing a What's in My Gym Bag tour because I have really been slacking at the gym lately because I've been having some um, work done around my house, so that's been preventing me from going to the gym, doing what I need to do, and eating as healthy as I normally eat. But now that my kitchen is all done, I'm able to get back in there and start cooking my healthy meals, and I'm trying to get myself back on track with my workouts. So I figure it, as you can see, I'm dressed because I'm actually getting ready to go to the gym as soon as I finish this video. So I said, why not show them what's in my gym bag? But before I do that, I'm going to give you a little bit of background, a little bit of background on uh, when I really started working out um, and why. So back in 2006, my father passed away from a stroke. He had heart disease. My mother is a diabetic and just watching my parents' health deteriorate because of um, diet and things like that. It just made me really want to start, you know, trying to control my health situation as much, much as I could. So in 2006, I started working out, but in 2009, I got really, really serious. I was about 167 pounds, and I had gotten down to 129 pounds, and I've maintained that weight for the past, what, 2017 now? So I've maintained that weight for the past eight years, but between last October and now, I've probably gained about... I want to say between 8 and 10 pounds back and I'm just not feeling like I normally feel I've been eating really bad so I've been feeling really tired really sluggish so I'm about to get back on my game I'm about to get back on my eating I'm getting back on my exercise so I figure I would share with y'all what's in my gym bag so let me stop talking let me stop rambling because I'll go on and on and on forever y'all know how I do because you know your girl likes to talk but anyway um also what I'm going to do, I'm going to show you a picture of me here uh, before I uh, went on my little weight loss journey, right here, and then here's a picture of me after, after I started my weight loss journey and have maintained it. So this picture right here is from last year, and this picture right here is from 2009. But anyway, I, um, I'm going to stop talking, let's get into this video, and let me show you all what's in my gym bag. Okay. So this is my gym bag and it's pink and I don't know why I'm not like a, a big pink lover but pretty much I always have something pink that I wear to the gym. Most of my gym clothes are pink. This isn't pink today but they're either pink or really really bright and you know I have my pink New York Giants hat that I that I absolutely love. But yes I have this pink gym bag. This is Under Armour and I got this off of Amazon. I love it. It, um, it has a couple of compartments and it has uh, straps in the back so it's perfect I can carry it with me while I'm working the whole time I'm working out and the first thing I'm going to show you that I have in this bag is my <clears throat> my sneakers I have I keep my gym shoes um, in my gym bag I do not wear my gym shoes to the gym because if you don't wear your gym shoes to the gym you can maintain them longer you shouldn't wear the, the same shoes that you work out in out in the street um, I either wear flip-flops in the summertime or my Ugg boots in the summer in the winter time and then I change into my gym shoes when I get to the gym so I have these Brook sneakers that I um, use when I'm running on the treadmill I love these shoes because they um, offer a lot of support and uh, my knees and my heels and stuff don't hurt when running in them. These are really good running shoes. And then I have my Under Armour. Sorry for all this rattling, guys. <clears throat> then I have my Under Armour sneakers that I use for the Stairmaster, Zumba, and uh, any other machines that I do, elliptical. You know, when I'm walking on the treadmill, I, I wear these too. But yeah, these, my Under Armour shoes. And then I have <clears throat> my uh, blender bottle. I keep this with me and I fill it with um, protein. So after I've worked out, I can go ahead and add water to this, go ahead and um, drink it and refuel my muscles because you are supposed to um, refuel your body with protein between 30 minutes to an hour after you've worked out. So I always try to keep my blender bottle, my blender bottle handy in my bag. And I got this at Walmart for like seven bucks. 
and um, oh the type of protein that I use I go to a lifetime fitness gym and they have them all around the country so some of y'all may be familiar with them some of y'all may not but they have their own brand of weight protein and this stuff is like really really good I used to get the protein from Walmart I don't know what kind it was but it was disgusting and I always had to mix it in a smoothie or something but this protein right here I could just add water to it I just add the water to it drink it like this and it tastes like a chocolate milkshake it's so good then I have my waist trimmer yes my little cheap waist trimmer that I got from um, home goods I paid like $5.99 for this thing and it actually works good it's not the corset type but didn't cost a corset corset type price either I got this from home goods and it works really really well I love this I keep this in my bag and I have my oops my handy dandy jump rope because a jump rope is a great way to get some cardio in if you don't feel like doing the machines i pay like seven dollars for this at walmart so yeah i have my my jump rope and then i have um what else do i have oh then in this pocket i have like several of my uh gym cards i have a couple because i'm always losing stuff so i like to have some extra so i have my gym cards and then in this front slot here, I have my must-have, my beats, because I cannot work out without my music. I'm telling you, if I get to the gym and my phone is dead, I turn around and go home, because the music is what motivates me. So I have to have my, my headphones, and so I can, hey, hey, while I'm working out to keep me motivated. Then I also have my weight gloves. Cause you know if you work out and if you if you if you're new to working out, you need to have these weight gloves if you're um, lifting weights because you don't want to get calluses on your hands and these will help prevent that from happening. Then I have some gum because I love chewing gum while I'm working out, so I gotta have my gum. I have some hand sanitizer. I have some feminine products. And then I have my deodorant because you do not want to be up in the gym smelling like subways because that ain't cute. But anyway, yeah, so that's pretty much all the stuff that I have in my gym bag. I just wanted to share it with y'all because I was like, I'm going to the gym. Why not show them what I have in my gym bag? So yeah, that's it. And um, yeah, that's going to do it for this video. And as always, I just want to say thank you so much for watching. Thanks for rolling with your girl. I love y'all and I will see you in my next video. Bye.